What's going on my friends? It's your boy Sai. In this video, I'm going to show you guys four, you know, five variations of push-ups, right? So mix it up in your workout. Um, just show you, show you every each one of the variations. I'll tell you quickly what's the emphasis, what muscles are being emphasized in each variation. And you guys take it from there, incorporate it into your workout, okay? So, variation number one, this is your standard wide grip push-up, right? So, wide grip push-up is basically you're gonna go about shoulder length, okay? You're gonna make sure, you're gonna look down, squeeze your, uh, your glutes and your abs, right? So make sure they're squeezed, right? Because you don't wanna like do a push-up like that. See, your, your back is hyperextended. And, and this applies to every variation, so I'm just gonna show you here. See, like this is a fucking terrible push-up, right? Like this, that's terrible, man. Like you're using your back, you're not doing it right, you're not hitting the right muscles, right? You wanna be looking down, squeeze your abs, squeeze your glutes, okay? About shoulder length. Take a breath down, touch your like your nose pretty much, and then back up again, okay? Breathe down, back up again. Breathe down, back up again. So. The wide grip, here we'll show you, I'll show you every variation from two angles. Right? That's gonna hit your chest, it's gonna hit pretty much this part, right? Pretty much your entire chest area. Mostly like you know, the middle, your entire chest area pretty much, right? So that's your standard push-up. Now, the second variation is the diamond. Diamond is gonna fo it's still gonna hit your chest, but it's gonna focus on your triceps. So it's a little bit harder because you're using a smaller muscle to push your own body weight, right? So you make a diamond, right? Make sure you're not flaring your elbows. And same rules apply. You're gonna squeeze your abs, squeeze your glutes, breath down, back up again, back up again, back up again. So again, the emphasis here is more on the triceps. Okay, but you still feel your chest, you're still gonna work on your chest. That's variation number two. Variation number three is clap push-up. Clap push-up is not gonna work so much on size, it's more of explosive strength, right? With size, you wanna like do reps, right? And take your time and put the muscle under tension. But a clap push-up, it's gonna focus on just explosive strength, right? Explosive. So this one, do it for explosive strength. For size, the other ones. You wanna, for size, every time you wanna increase size, you wanna put your muscle under tension, right? Which brings me to number four, variation number four. A pause push-up or an isometric push-up, right? Get in a regular push-up stance, wide grip, or sorry, shoulder, shoulder width. You're gonna go down, and you're gonna just pause there for 10, 15 seconds, right? Two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And go back up again and do it again. One, two, three. You get that idea, right? And back up again. Isometrics, I'm gonna make a separate video on isometrics. I love isometric training. You basically get all the muscle fibers to fire. You train your body. So by pausing at the bottom, you're training your chest to fire up all the muscle fibers. Because if you're just always going with reps and it's quick, there are some muscle fibers that are not activated. Isometrics activate them, right? So over time, you'll have more muscle fibers coming into the lift, which inevitably will increase, make, make, make more gains, strength gains, size gains, and uh, you'll have better control over your muscle, right? It also develops mind-muscle connection. So that's variation number four. Last variation I wanna show you guys. Um, is elevated push-ups or chair push-ups or whatever the fuck, incline push-ups. That's gonna focus more on your upper chest, right? So get a chair. Okay, that's gonna focus on the upper chest, but we'll also work out pretty much your entire chest. Right, it's just a different angle. So, 
incorporate these variations into your workout, right? They're going to hit different things. Asymmetrics, like I said, will help you recruit more muscle fibers. Um, and clap push-up is for explosive strength. The other ones, the other three, elevated, so incline. Uh, and then wide grip and diamond. Diamond's for triceps. Wide grip is for your chest. Inclines for your upper chest, right? So incorporate them. They're pretty cool. And that's it. Check out SayMobite.com for inspiration, for empowerment. I also got a program, a body weight program. It has these exercises and many more, right? So check it out. I'll leave it in the comments in the description. It's called Bodyweight Kings. Uh, that's it. And um, yeah, as always, don't forget to subscribe or you're going to stick with the fishes.